right so what we have here is the pinging preference the self ping what it will do later on when you uh, install the script uh, the little code that it will give you once you install it on your site um, if you have the self ping selected it will ping the page that this, that this code is on if a visitor lands on it and again the visitor has to be uh, 24 hours unique so if the visitor returns in five minutes it will not uh, call the, the ping action again it will only do it, it will only do it in a 24 hour period um, if you have the self ping on it will ping the very page that the visitor is on which is also the page where the script would be on um, if you use the custom pinging and, and generally, okay, maybe just to clarify, let's say you have your uh, this, this script installed on the very main page, on the index page, and let's assume that's where all the traffic is coming. Um, you might want to switch over, especially if you get a lot of traffic, you might want to switch over to custom pinging and just paste all your different uh, pages in here, your website pages, just so they all get a fair amount, equal amount of pinging instead of the one main page getting all the pinging. Does that make sense? So really what you do is just copy paste all your web pages in here. And um, and the beauty with the custom pinging is is that you can install the script on one page, one site, but advertise like ping a completely different website with it. Um, and you don't have to add a little code to the other website at all. So there's a lot of advantages, but again, it really is up to you. Um, use it whatever works best for you um, yeah it's up to your own judgment on that one okay the other thing too though is um, let's say you don't want to ping your pages directly uh, what you can do is you can uh, post some backlinks in here as well just copy paste some backlinks in here as well there's a separate box for that down here but you can also do it here if, you, if you'd like um, the idea why we split it up is later on when it creates an RSS feed um, from this campaign. Um, this way, it'll take 10 URLs from this box and 10 from this box. Um, so again, like it's it's just a matter of getting things mixed up uh, nicely and not to appear spammy ever to any ping aggregators or to the search engines. So. Um, but it, again, it's really up to you how you want to use it. Uh, but just be creative with it. Paste any web pages in here that you want pinged. Okay.